Well, I tell you what, I'm looking at my jewelry and that crazy daughter, granddaughter of mine, ever since she got out of the asylum, I can't keep nothing. She's stealing everything I own. She's nutty as a fruitcake, I'm telling you. I wish the hell I'd never let her in here. Man, she's driving me nuts. Well, good morning, Jennifer. As you know, this is your monthly assessment. So tell me, how do you feel like you've been doing since you've been released from the institution? Um, I think it's going really well. Um, I'm getting my life back right now. I think things are just falling back into place. Well, that's good to hear. I'm glad to hear you say that. Now, have you been staying away from fire since your release? Yeah. I haven't touched it, actually, at all. Not at all? Not playing with matches every once in a while, keeping that ladder under your bed? No, nothing. Wow, it does sound like you're really making some progress. Anything in your life that you're looking forward to? Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm about to graduate, and uh, I have a new boyfriend, so... Is there anything in your life right now that you're missing?
Can't you see? I did all of this for you. For us! For us? You've been terrorizing me. I've been getting them out of our way. There is nothing in our way anymore. I want a normal life now, Alex. I don't want this. You call this normal? It is normal. What is normal for you? We've never been normal. We've always been set apart. You and me, together! It's too late. It's been a month since our last visit. When we visited before, you said everything was going well, and it appeared to be. Tell me, how have you been doing with the goals that you set for yourself? Um, good. I've, I've had a lot of closure, and I've met them all. That's great. Huh? Mm -hmm. So tell me about fire. You still staying away from fire? Yeah. 